craft books. So, <laughs> well, two of them anyway, about vintage slash flea market type crafts. So you could likely find some of the stuff in these there or wherever. So you got have yourself a very vintage Christmas crafts, decorating tips and recipes, 1920s to 1960s. Includes instructions for 50 craft projects by Susan Wagoner. Wagoner. So, as it suggests, you're getting very kind of like vintage now kind of crafts. You got like some tips on basic materials like scotch positionable mountain adhesive by 3M. So, and it just, for each decade you get this like style file <coughs> on like how to decorate for that or like for that decade. So like paper, colors, home, Like, in this one you got, like, to make a 20s tree. And then you got different things to do. So, like, medallions. And you got an image of what it would look like. Christmas postcards. A glitter garland. So. And you got, for each one you got, like, these quick crafts to do. So package seal, silhouettes, toys in the tree kind of thing. And then for 1930s, it's pretty much the same setup with one or two, like two or three things would change in each uh, file. And then you got the same kind of like thing, like certain crafts you could do for each one. And you get the quick, quick crafts again. So you got all that until the 1960s. And you got like a few recipes. Caramels, turtles, um, almond bark. So, and at the end you got an art portfolio. Which includes the images in some of the crafts. Like, this is for each picture is for a craft that was talked about um, earlier, so I think this one is for a tea towel. So, and I think like one of the crafts is the silhouette of um, that Scottish Terrier. Um, you got the tags kind of thing. So, if you want to go kind of like old school, early on, kind of Christmas um, decor or gift giving or like a theme to your Christmas kind of thing. Something, so you got this book. So depending on where you are, US 1995, Canada 2295, and UK 1299. So you got this one and Next one, you could do with stuff all year round, it isn't holiday specific. So you got vintage crafts, 75 do-it-yourself decor decorating projects using candles, colors, and other flea market finds by Clara Lidstrom. So, and you got like this hardcover, thick cardboard cover binding. So... This one isn't a full step by step on how to do every single project. So, so like these are two things you could do as well. And like for this one, like kitchen towel bedding, bed cover of kitchen towels, she tells you how to make this one. So, not every single one is like that 
it's, um, you got how to make waffles. So a lot of them are, you got like two or three like this, and then one main one that to make. So simple things and a quick picture of it. And she has like her beloved dresses. So things you could find at Green Cleaner. So at flea markets or like thrift stores or something. And it goes into a few different rooms. Uh, she has regarding flea market section. The commandments of flea markets. So locate current garage sales in local newspaper weekend editions. Cash is king and a few other things. So in with the old, out with the new type things. So it's continuing on like that, and she has a lot of different photo like photos in here as well. So composing. So it's a little more than do-it-yourself projects. You got the other information as well. So if you want to do more of that, this book can be of help. So it only has a US price of like $17.95, so Canadian price would likely be about $20, because $20 to $22 maybe. Um, but yeah, so if you are the type of person who goes to flea markets or wanting that vintage look, this could be a book for you to have a look at. I just got it at my local library, so it's possible yours is too. Maybe there's an ebook version of this. But yeah. Vintage Crafts by Clara Lindstrom. So happy readings and happy crafting if you do have a look at these.